how you can start implementing visuals into your everyday life right now. I'm a live scribe and illustrator and I want to share my knowledge around visual thinking with you. Visual thinking is integral to my communication and my customers, people just like you. So if you're interested in learning some quick and simple icons for you to use in every day, follow along. I'm going to walk through drawing three icons that I use every day. These work particularly well when bringing together lots of information, maybe creating a project plan or working out how those elements fit together. The three quick and simple icons you'll be able to draw are cogs, jigsaws and arrow streams. When sketchnoting or live scribing, I like to use a variety of different pens, including the Posca bullet tip, the Posca brush pen nib, and a Faber-Castell fine liner. For this demonstration, I'll be using the Posca bullet nib. So let's go in with a cog. Rather than trying to draw a perfect circle and then do the notches, we're going to actually do the notches first almost like dashes. So let's work our way around. This can be a really rough circle like this and within each one we simply make a, almost like a trench shape working our way all the way around and you can see here it doesn't have to be perfect and finish with a circle in the middle. We can also add in smaller ones so if you're working through a project or a system, you can really create these simple cogs and maybe inside each one, you can label it with what it is and how it works together. Our second one is a jigsaw. This one's fairly simple. You could start with a square or rectangle and add in those shapes. But realistically, it is quite simple to corner and add those rounded shapes in, working our way around that square. And you can always add in other ones. So maybe they have to fit together slightly differently. And by using some connectors, we can join together these ideas and again, label them with what needs to be done and what's joining together. My final example is an arrow, but one that has a stream of different things coming in to create an outcome. So we can create the arrow head, which is a triangle that has an open section here. Draw the two lines wider than you think they need to be. And then by drawing three short lines here, this gives us the guideline to join together. So for this one, I'd be putting the incomes here, so the ideas and the options here, and then the outcome, I'm gonna use a star to represent the outcome here. So we've got movement and organization of ideas. So these are my three quick icon tips for this week. Look out for my new icon tips next week and let me know where you'll be using your cog, jigsaw and arrow.